is up guys, welcome back to my channel, my name is Lance, hello, how are ya? Today, as you guys can tell from the title of this video, I'm going to be doing a little ASOS haul for you guys. It's gonna be a bit of a mixture, I have a bunch of packages here that I'm basically gonna open up for you guys later on. I also have a rack of clothes down here that I've already worn. I actually have purchased all these clothes around two months ago. These clothes are very creased because they just came out from the wash. I do also want to note that all my social media is down below. As always, like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified on brand new videos. Okay, so first up, I'm gonna go through the trousers. Now, before you guys go crazy, the only reason why I went for white jeans is because I wanted to try something different. I'm just gonna tiptoe so you guys can get on frame. It's not too bad, to be honest. The only problem that I have with this, other than getting stained really quickly, is that it's a button-up one. It is a chino, which is understandable. It's normally just button-up. Next up are these black cargo jeans, 25 pounds. These are the ASOS Design Classic Rigid Jeans with cargo pocket in. And when I finally got to wear something that wasn't skinny, wasn't tugging on my leg hairs, I fell in love with them. And also you can fit a lot in them as well. Okay, so with this next one, um, this is the Top Man Sweat in Black. And I feel like every person should have a black sweater slash jumper that they should keep in the closet. As you can see, it is a crew neck fit. Now I have a really long skinny neck, which can be accentuated by different fits of clothes. And crew necks normally fit me the most. The, it's more flattering for me, at least in my opinion anyways. It cuts off my neck here, so it doesn't, even though I do have a big, bit of a bubble head sometimes. This is practically my most favorite, most worn jumper, mainly because it's black. Love the color black. It goes with a lot of outfits, very comfy, um, and yeah, I don't know, I just feel good wearing it. I don't know why. Um, normally I would style this with a watch. Um, if I put in my cross necklace, I practically look like a priest. Can you guys? You'll see that, that theme going, no priest moment. Um, but essentially, it goes with pretty much any accessories. This one I also got on sale January time before Rona happened properly. This is my go-to one for it. It's very warm, very autumn-y type of thing. I do feel like people could just lay on me and make a picnic, but still. I also have another one. It's this one. By the way, these two jackets weren't taken from ASOS. I believe these were the last jackets or items of clothing that I purchased from the store directly this year. Actually, no, not this one. I bought this over a year ago. That one, the previous one, alongside this long one, which I haven't really worn in a while. Yep, that goes with, <laughs> that, goes with that one. It goes with pretty much any outfit. Anyways, um, so this was originally £20 and I got it for 15 Okay, the next one is another basic. In fact, most of these are going to be basic, the ones that I'm going to keep anyways. I like the fit of it because it's more of a relaxed fit. I don't really normally wear like skin tight or muscle tight fit because my body type is skinny. I am working on getting that to not skinny anymore. This was only £8 as well, so quite good. It is a bit thin, but not too thin that you can see my nipples. At least I hope not. But... <laughs> This was good for the summer. Same with this blue one, actually, I will try this on next. Okay, so this is the blue shirt that I was on about. It's a baby blue shirt. Um, this one is more of a longer length than the gray one. In fact, I prefer the gray one normally. Yeah, it can be a bit bright, and sometimes I do feel like I work for Primark wearing this. The blue looks good on my skin, right? Is that just me? Next one is this white waffle shirt. This was also eight pounds. Okay, so this is the white waffle shirt that I got. I believe this one is from Bershka. Yes, it is from Bershka. So I've already had a white waffle shirt before. Um, this is the waffle texture that I'm on about. This was originally $12.99 and I got it for $10.35. So this is another one of those um, shirts that is pretty much essential for anyone's closet. I like the fact that it's a crew neck fit at the top and it's more of a boxy kind of relaxed fit as well. Um, but yeah, now this one I didn't actually purchase myself. This was a gift from my sister. I believe this is an A crew, A crew, A crew shirt. Normally I layer this on top of this or the black jumper or just anything simple, or I just wear it by itself. But still, that's what it looks like close up. It goes well with my skin tone. I did think when I got it that it was gonna blend in with my skin, but I actually do kind of just like it. It brings out a good tone out of my skin. 
All right, last but not the least is this rugby egg crew shirt again. Basically, this is longer than myself. This would be good for winter. It is very, very comfy. I do have to tuck this in, otherwise I do look like I'm wearing a skirt. Okay, so as you guys can see, once again, I know it is creased. So you guys can see, it is pretty much a bigger fit on me. If I position it like this so that it doesn't hang that much, it's not too bad. You get a lot of golfing um, jokes out of this one, especially if I tuck it in, but look, if I just let it hang loose down to the very bottom, can you see what I'm on about? About how big it is. It looks like... <laughs> it looks like I'm wearing a shirt. Uh, a skirt. So normally I can tuck it in. But it's not really the greatest, to be honest. Um, it's kind of like... You will hear from my father vibes. Post jock. Post jock, what am I on about? So first up, I have this... ASOS designed oversized linen shirt with Reverie, Revere, color in pink. Now I don't really have a lot of pink items in my closet, mainly because I feel like I don't really pull it off that often. Hmm, I don't know. Well. <laughs> um, I just feel like it's quite a bright color for me. Okay, so this is, I mean, it's a bit big. I don't really know how to feel about this. Why does it point so high up? Is that how it's meant to be? It's also a very itchy material. I feel like I could just... This is not it. Bruh. What? Look at the amount of space there is there. I don't mind it like flaring out a tiny bit, like maybe like that much, or maybe even just having it like... Maybe it's because I don't have any muscles, but still though, like that is a large gap. I'm bringing this one back. Next one though, we have an ASOS Design Searsucker, another Reverie one. This doesn't fit. Ooh, okay. You guys see that? Well, you guys can't feel it. Not as itchy as this one. We're gonna see. Oh boy. I have a feeling we're gonna have the same problem. Look at how, I feel like this, oh my days, this is bigger. Oh wow. Oh wow, okay. Okay. <laughs> um. I look like I'm about to head to sleep. This would be a good nighttime outfit, not gonna lie. I like the color, I like the texture of it. It's just the fit of it. I look, it looks like a pajama. This is what you're meant to wear out on a date? Or like on, on a, on a, I don't know. Where would you wear this to other than the bed? I mean, it's not too bad, I guess. But I don't know. What do you guys think? Comment down below. <laughs> Anyways, next one. This is from New Look. It's a sweatshirt A jumper. This next one isn't too bad. I do like the stripes. I don't really have a lot of stripes in my closet. I did try this on very, very briefly when I first got the packages. Um, it's not too bad, to be honest. Maybe just the drop shoulder that I was kind of annoyed with. I'm not even sure if it's meant to be drop shoulder. It is a bit more baggy, but as I said, I do need to gain a bit more weight to just fill it in. Can you guys, what would you rate it out of 10? It's definitely not a 10, but it's definitely not a five either, right? It's a bit more eh. Maybe it is a five, I don't quite know. I don't know, I don't know. It's not too, it's not too bad. Next up is this gray shirt. Burton menswear, Oxford shirt, anyway. basically, right? Anything from Burton's doesn't really fit me well, and I don't know why. This was originally 20 pounds and I got it for 16. I believe I did try it on when I first got the package, but I don't think it fit me that well. Okay, so it's definitely tight. Obviously, once again, it is creased. It's not too bad, I do like the color. I feel like if I do gain weight again, it's just gonna be super, super tight because it's already tight enough now. I think I like it actually. <laughs> it is very, very creased as you guys can see on camera. This one was not because of the wash, this is because it was in the packaging. I think I rolled it up badly. Yeah, we'll keep this one. It's not too bad, is it? I don't know. Last one. This is <laughs> a super skinny cargo trousers in blue. This one is a very experimental one, basically. So I saw this on ASOS and I was like, you know what? That could be a, a fun look. I was feeling a bit adventurous with this one. I have a feeling this one is definitely gonna go back though. Can you guys see how glittery? <laughs> Can you guys see how glittery that is? This one was, oh shit. This was originally 40 pounds, 
but I got it for £15.40. Let's hope it's worth it. I really don't know how to feel about this pattern. Can you guys see that on camera? It's like a purpley slash blue sheen. It's... <laughs> wow, okay. I ordered... This is like the type of thing you'd wear to a prom, but also not a prom. Oh wow, okay. It's very... <laughs> it's very elastic, guys. <laughs> Oh wow, that's actually really comfortable. This little flap is just not doing it for me. But the fit itself isn't bad. Like, it's actually not bad. Wow, I'm actually surprised. It's really comfy as well. It doesn't look bad. I'm not sure if you guys can see that on camera. You can do proper squats with this one. What even? That was not a proper squat, but still. This is a weird purchase, but definitely definitely interesting i feel like in the future i'll find something of use for this one also before i go though i did also splurge on two bags the first one is this one it's basically like a mini backpack with any bags that i buy i make sure that there's a lot of compartments so you can actually make use of it it's not just like a for the looks type of bag but look you can add in maybe an ipad mini ipad add in your pens this would be good for out for like festivals. So you can either have it as one strap or you can get, there's another strap that comes with it that you can probably wear as a backpack. So this, oh wow, okay. So this crossbody backpack was originally 50 pounds. Can you believe it? 50 pounds and I got it for 18 pounds. But as I said, this would be good. Like if you're out traveling, especially after this whole Rona situation goes, like if you're out traveling, this would be perfect. But I think the strap itself is too big. It just looks like I'm wearing a sash. So the next one is another consigned bag. Let me see. This one was 40 pounds originally as well, and I got it for 15 pounds. So I got 62% off. Let me see. So it's a clear backpack. It's also got, see this is the type of strap I'm on about. If the strap for the other bag, this one, was as small as this, then yes. Actually no, maybe a bit bigger than this because it's a much bigger backpack. But it's a clear, oh, okay. I'm not so sure about the color. Actually no, I kind of like it. <laughs> if you want to wear this bag, make sure that the things inside it aren't like weird because obviously it's very clear. I don't really know what type of outfit would go. I don't, I don't think I have an outfit that goes with this bag, but still. It's worth a try. It is very cute, look at that. This, once again, I'm just looking forward to like festival season next year or the other next, the year after that. I don't quite know when festivals are gonna be back up. Probably get dirty quickly, but it's a nice little bag. All right, and that about concludes the video that I have for you guys today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. As always, like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get brand new, blah, blah, to get notified on brand new videos coming every week. It would mean a lot to me if you guys share this video. Um, I will hopefully be posting more fashion videos, but we'll see how it goes. For the next few videos, it's gonna be a mixture of everything. I just wanna test things out. Um, there might be an ASMR video coming up. There might be a little chit down, chit down, what? Sit down chat, <laughs> chit chat is what I meant. Sit down chat. At, um, talking about school or if you want me to try any other types of videos comment down below I'll be posting more singing videos as well so stay tuned for that and as always have a great day and stay safe